Atlantic City's Borgata Casino reopened its doors to the public this afternoon. The last casino to get back in business after the shutdown. Eyewitness News reporter Howard Monroe gives us a look at their new way to play. I just won a whole lot of money and I'm feeling fabulous. I just put $20 in the machine and I won big today. The good times are once again rolling at the Borgata. After being closed to the general public since mid-March, the casino floor is back open for business. There's nothing worse than a casino with no people. What makes the casino come to life is our employees and our customers. But while they are open, there are some changes. Temperature checks are in place at the entrance for employees and customers. Every other slot machine was disabled. There are two hand washing stations on the casino floor and plastic barriers were installed to separate customers and dealers at the tables. You really can't talk to people because you have plexiglass behind you and it's hard to interact with the dealer because again the plexiglass between you. But I guess this is the new normal and you either have to take it or leave it. Also, it is important to note that when you're in the casino, your mask must be worn at all times. This is whether you are sitting at a slot machine or at a table or walking around. Right now, we're accepting this as our new normal. We've got to make sure that uh, we abide by all the state mandates. The Borgata is the last casino to reopen in Atlantic City. The others opened leading up to the 4th of July. Management held off reopening because indoor dining still isn't allowed in New Jersey. According to the state's gaming division, in June alone, gambling revenue was down over 65% compared to June of 2019. For the people here, they're just happy to be winning again. I am so God blessed, so thank you for God and for making my day. In Atlantic City, Howard Monroe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.